So I was actually looking through my Pocahontas collection and I was thinking quite a lot of it I did actually do in my last video. I didn't actually leave myself a lot to do in this one. Um, so I thought this time I will do a little bit of Pocahontas but I thought I'd mainly focus on Miko. Now Miko if you don't know it is uh, the raccoon in Pocahontas. It's actually one of uh, Pocahontas psychics. And I've got a few things here which are technically can be with Pocahontas but at the same time I was like I'm just going to try and focus on Miko if I can just because he is quite cute and I do have quite a few things of Miko that I could show you guys but yeah like I said I didn't really leave myself a lot of things from my last video it's almost like I did everything for my Pocahontas shrine last time in the last video and I was like that, that, that's great Kim thanks for leaving yourself something to do this time hello everyone and welcome to Disney Shrine so if you're new here then twice a week I do videos why do I forget every single time I've been doing this for six months so on Tuesdays I do a haul, so my next one I'm going to do is my Primark one, which I've got the bag, it's literally, can you see it, it's just there, so I've got the Primark one there, and then on Fridays, which is this video, is something from the shrine, like I said, so this is Pocahontas, but primarily Miko. I'm also doing a giveaway, so let's say to the end of the video, and all the details will be there for you. So the first things I'm going to talk about was some things I actually talked in my last video. So apologies if you're binge watching these videos and I talk about the same thing. So I thought if I do the ones I did in my last one again, um, just in case you know you are new to this channel, just in case this might be your first time. But I thought if I just do those ones first and then the ones that are new to this particular video, you obviously get at the end. So we'll get through the, the first ones, you know. So the first one, like I said, this is one I did actually talk about in my my last book contest video is this one here so this is a key ring now this one actually comes out of a mystery pack so what it is is on the back of the mystery pack it actually shows you potential key rings you can get now I know with these ones you can get them with the psychic and without so they've got like different series um, if I can remember bear with no, unfortunately, in my last video, I didn't actually write what series this one came from. So you can get Pocahontas just by herself, or they have started to do new ones where you actually get the psychic with her. And I just think these are really cute. The little picture of Miko down there. It's just so, like, it's just so squished down there. These ones, because they're mystery packs, range in between, I would say, five to seven pounds, depends on where you get them from. Um, the main places I get mine from are actually, like, comic book shops. So whenever we go to Southampton, apart from obviously going to Disney store, we all always go to Forbidden Planet and that's where I get most of my key rings, like ones like these, like the 3D ones, that's where I tend to get most of mine from there. Um, best places, hashtag not sponsored, or obviously like eBay, the Facebook groups, which I obviously will link them down below for you. I will try and find those on eBay because that would be the easiest place for me to get it from. So if for whatever reason I can't, maybe try the Facebook groups, like I said before in previous videos, that if there's something you're looking for, and let's say not on eBay, Amazon, that kind of thing, maybe just ask someone in one of the groups, because you never know, they might have one to sell you. Um, the mystery packs are good and bad. For example, I always look at the back and I kind of feel like, because they're about, you know, like five, seven pounds, give or take. And I always feel like, I look at the back and I'm like, if there's enough there I like, then I would actually buy the packet. Well, you know, say for example, it might be 12 to collect. But I'm thinking if there's like seven, eight, maybe nine that I like, then I will actually buy the packets. But if I look at the packet and be like, mm, there's only like one or two I like, that's when I get mine on eBay. Just because I don't want to spend like five pounds, 10 pounds, 15 pounds keep getting characters I don't actually want because um, there are I know I love Disney but there are some Disney characters I don't actually like whereas all actually correction um, actually let me rephrase that there are, there are some characters I prefer over others so it's not like I don't like them it's just uh, there are other characters I prefer over the ones I don't like. <laughs> so with this one, I was actually lucky enough to get this one in a mystery pack because I did actually like quite a few in the packet. Um, but like I said, if not, eBay is the best place to go. Now the next one, like I said, I did mention this one in my last video, so apologies again if you've already seen these ones, but it's a Zoom Zoom of uh, Miko. Now, these ones were three pounds from the Disney store. I did actually buy these in the set, so in my last video you would have seen, obviously I bought quite quite a few of them. But like I said, I just want to talk about the Miko ones at the moment. Um, I have mentioned before that I do quite like the Zoom Zoom ones, just because I feel like the more they do, I feel like the better they've become. So for example, I feel like there's a bit more detail in there. You've got things that kind of stick out, obviously a little tail as well. I just kind of feel like the design is a little bit better. 
I think... Oh, yes, I remember. I remember the story now. So if you didn't know, me and Ruben were actually getting married. It's actually less than three weeks. At the, when, when this video goes up, it'll be less than three weeks. So we're actually gonna go on a honeymoon in Disneyland, Florida. Now, when we booked our tickets for Disneyland, Florida, they actually gave me, uh, I think it was like a 15% off voucher to use in the Disney store. Now for me, because the Disney store is not that actually close, it's in Southampton, so it's like 45 minutes away, it is sometimes easier for me to order online than it is to drive there, because obviously petrol, it costs more than, you know, obviously post and packaging. So PMP, if it's under fifty pounds, is about three pounds. I say about three pound ninety-five, if I remember rightly. Now, so when I, you know, had this fifteen percent code, I thought, great, that's almost like free delivery. So I bought this one. I bought the other Pocahontas one. So I think they just launched, like I said, February time. Uh, and so I did actually buy all these with the code that Disney gave me, like I said, when we ordered our, our park tickets. So yeah, so that's the story with that one. So I do remember getting these ones at a slightly discounted price, but they are normally three pounds. I don't think they're on the Disney Store website at the moment. If they are, I will link it down below for you, but I'm pretty sure they're not on there anymore. Um, I have seen them in the Facebook group, so for example, yet again, people selling them, um, just have a look around there, so like, you know, I will link them down below. Or yet again, eBay, so I will try and find on eBay for you. If you wanted all of them, I will try and find the set as well for you. But yes, that's that one. Now, I'm pretty sure the other ones I've not talked about. One of them, actually I lied, one of them I had talked about I think in my very very first video when I talked about like picking one item from every section of the show to talk about. So technically I talked about this but I didn't show the other things. So it's actually one of these which is um, the stickers from the sticker album that it came out. So this is the like unopened ones, this one I talked about but I did buy a few which I opened. So these ones I actually opened and I, I, said, I think I got about three or four because I think the seller at the time was selling like a, a few packets at a time. So I thought, okay, I'll get one that I won't open, but I'll get some that I will because I actually wanted to see the stickers inside. So these are the Miko ones inside. Now I really like Miko. I think he's really cute. Um, I have said before in previous videos that I don't really like psychics because sometimes I feel like they're almost like a pointless character. Um, I don't want to name names, but you know, kind of like uh, Pua from uh, Moana. I kind of feel like if you took him out of the film, would you really notice? I'm not saying he's a bad character. I'm not saying that he's not cute. I'm just saying, was it really worth having him in? Whereas I kind of feel like Miko, is a worthwhile character because obviously if you haven't seen the film where have you been go go stop this go watch the film and then come back so there is a part in the film spoiler like i said if you haven't seen it where Miko is obviously interested by John Smith and obviously goes up to him, you know, eats his biscuits, that kind of thing. So Miko kind of helps the plot along. He's not just there, he's not just a character. Flit, on the other hand, I'm just like, man, you know, could have maybe done without Flit being in there, but I kind of feel like Miko is a little bit of a comic relief because Pocahontas is a little bit like a serious film. It's one of the more serious films. Serious? Serial? Serious. It's one of the most serious films, but so I feel like you need Miko as like a little bit of a, like a comic relief. So I, I do actually like him, and these ones I got I quite liked because these are the ones that you, you, if I remember rightly, I did actually have the sticker album, but these ones were kind of. Um, uh, just kind of like random on the page so obviously the sticker album was to do with the actual film so it'd be like you know clips from the film things like that whereas these kind of stickers were just like randomly around around the book so they were kind of like fun stickers I would say Ooh. Ooh. I have to stop yawning sorry I've been up since 7 because I've been at work all day and I am now tired it is it's half past 5 now and I haven't had my nap <laughs> So yeah, so if I remember rightly, like I said, I got these on eBay. They weren't that expensive. I think for the actual packet, I think because you get six in the packet, I think they were about, yeah, I think they were like 50 pence each or something. So I don't remember who the original seller was that I got these from, but like I said, I will try and find 
the actual unopened packets if I can but sometimes you actually get people who sell opened ones for example in my Lion King one there was someone on there who were, had like 50 stickers or something and you just paid like a pound for like five or something like that and then you request which stickers you wanted because I remember at the time I just said can I just have any Scar ones that you've got because Scar is my favourite character uh, from the Lion King so I did sort of say you know can I just have any Scar pictures you've got and they're the ones that they sent me right so the next one this actually came part of a set I have mentioned these before in previous videos when I got this one I actually got this in a big set so this actually had like loads of princesses with it and it had their psychics with it unfortunately you can't get the big set anymore because when I bought it I did actually get it in the sale and this was almost two years ago I think it was almost uh, I think it was like mm, October November time two years ago which was 2016 uh, so it doesn't exist anymore but like I said I can try and find the big set if you wanted the big set if not they do do the smaller sets but only the princesses you get the small sets so I think it's the big set you get the psychics but like I said if you're looking for certain characters like I said if you want the, the Miko one I will try and find it for you so the set you got so you've got actually Pocahontas like I said princess so you can still get her in the set with the other princesses but the one I got actually had the psychics so you got Miko and Flit there and I just really like this. Um, some of the psychics I didn't actually keep, which I'm regretting now because now I need them for my videos. But at the time, I didn't, I didn't really like them, so I thought I'll just give them to charity, that kind of thing. Some of them, like Meek and Flit, I did actually keep because I just saw that kind of scene itself is quite cute, where they it almost like they're talking to each other, you know, maybe you know, just. You know, Miko's asking Flit how his book's going, you know, if he's uh, met any girls recently, that kind of thing. You know, I just, you never know what goes on. But, um, but yeah, I just thought that was a really cute little scene of them two together. And I also do like Miko as well, so that's one reason I did, did actually keep this. But, but like I said, they don't do this one anymore, but like I will try and find uh, them for you. The only place I can imagine this being now is actually eBay. I couldn't tell you how much they would be because when I bought the set, like I said, it was in the sale. I think you got like 12 princesses and obviously the psychics that went with it. And I'm trying to think... I think I got mine for like something stupid, like I think it was like originally £30 down to £15, so I think I almost got like half price, which for me, knowing how many characters you got, I was like, oh my god, that's really good, you know, so that, that worked out to be like, you know, under a pound per character, so I was thinking, you know, not going to get any cheaper than that, so I like to think something like this, possibly about £5 on eBay, just on the basis, you've got to think P&P as well, like, I don't know if you want the Pokemon this one, I will try to find Pokemon this if I can as well, if I remember right, Rightly, actually, Pocahontas might still be available on the Disney Store website. So, if I can find both of these, I will also link it down below for you. Now, the last one, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I got this from a. No, I'm pretty sure I actually got this from eBay. It's one of those things, I think, because I did actually go for a phase of trying to collect McDonald's toys and uh, Burger King toys. And I have a feeling this might have been in a bag with other items. So I didn't buy this by... Oh, shush. Oh. I didn't buy this by itself, I did actually buy this I think in a bag, so I think I paid like £5 and it had loads of different like Burger King McDonald's toys in it. Some of them I gave to charity and then some I actually kept. So this is one of the ones I kept, so it is, if I remember rightly, this one, so yeah, so this is Burger King. It doesn't say a year so I couldn't tell you when but I'm assuming it's either when the film came out of the cinema or when the film came out on like VHS, DVD, that kind of thing but it's like a wind up Miko and sorry it's loud <laughs> but yeah it's just him, he's just eating a biscuit. The funny thing is, his head moves, and I'm thinking, Miko, your head's moving around away from the biscuit. Um, he also, oh, speaking of biscuits, the cat just came in. If you didn't know, I have two cats. One's called Biscuit and one's called Cookie. So just in case you didn't know, if you don't watch my vlogs, they are my vlogs quite frequently. Um, 
but they're just being being nosy also in my vlogs you can see the rest of this room it's just covered in bags full of wedding decorations so um yeah the cat's trying to get through and i'm like yeah good luck this one i don't think i can show you but yeah oh no <laughs> okay so um yeah so this actually has a wheels on the bottom as well so when you obviously wind it up not only does he eat the biscuit but it also moves around the table as well so that's quite a fun trick um i can't say if i could find him by himself um he might be with other things like that like how i got it so obviously i will try and find it down below as well for you and so i said i can't guarantee that someone would be sending that one some of the um toys i have got do come in sets so you might be lucky enough ooh, you might be lucky enough to actually get miko with say pocahontas john smith or any other toys that came in the uh in the 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 batch um but that's the only one i've got um of that because um I do have, I do have some other ones. Ah, okay, so I've actually got a John Smith Burger King one, so he might have come in the same packet as me, because I say I did get some other uh, toys while I was there. Um, they just, like I said, it's about like five, about five pounds for like five toys which is obviously a pound each and it was just like random toys um i like i said i can't remember what the other ones were because i did go for a phase of obviously buying quite a few different ones um like bidding for them and buying them and things like that just because i knew i was going to be obviously doing um something to do with the shrine so i started to like buy items that i could obviously talk talk more about um so yeah so i can't remember which ones i got with it but i will link down below if i can find that one or more Pocahontas items for you. So now I have zoomed the camera out, I will... He does go quite fast, I hope I can catch you on camera. You ready? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so, yeah. He kind of goes in all different directions. He doesn't go like in a straight line. So yeah, so hopefully you saw that, but that was Miko just obviously going around. Um, but like I said, I will try and find all of these on eBay for you if I can. Hashtag not sponsored. I have to say I'm not sponsored just on the basis that I do talk about eBay a lot just because that's where I get most of my stuff because a lot of my items are quite old. Some of these I actually bought when they originally came out, which means obviously in shops they don't exist anymore. So that's why I have to say I'm not sponsored. If eBay, if you want to sponsor me, you know, let me know. Disney, if you want to sponsor me, let me know as well. You know, obviously I have said before in previous videos and I also said in my vlog, if I ever, ever, ever get anyone to sponsor me, you guys will be the first one to know because I'm going to be so excited that I'm actually getting a sponsor that, you know, the fact that to get a sponsor you need to have like a certain amount of views and a certain amount of likes. So, you know, please, you know, like these videos, subscribe, all that jazz. Um, you know, then obviously one day maybe I can get sponsored, which means I can buy more stuff for you guys. Because like I said, a lot of this stuff I do have to buy on eBay, you know, um, because I've got a wedding to pay for, and then a honeymoon to pay for, and then obviously it's going to be Christmas. You know, I, I would like to, you know, try and buy more stuff for you guys. So if we can try and get these videos, like more likes, more views, more subscribers, that kind of thing. Hopefully one day I might get someone who sponsored me, which then I can buy more stuff for you guys. And obviously I can buy stuff for like Primark, Disney Store, you know, things like that so it doesn't just stop at ebay so you know just just planting the seed just putting it out there right so time for the giveaway so if you're new to my channel what the giveaway is is you get to pick any picture from my facebook fancy arts page and it all comes a4 canvas and it's also free pp as well for you so you get to pick any picture you like it doesn't have to be any of my disney ones so you can pick any picture so all you need to do to enter is to like and subscribe to this youtube channel like i said i'd be so grateful if you can give thumbs up if you can share these videos if you know anyone else who likes disney then uh, you know please send them my way and then head over to my Facebook page and like that. And if you follow me on Instagram, I'll also follow you back. I do actually have the rules down below. So just in case I went through that too quickly, if you don't understand, I have actually put them in the description and all the links are there as well for you. Um, so once you've done that, if you'd like to actually put in the comment section that you've done that, so I'll say no to ending the competition. So once I get to 500 subscribers, I'll pick three of you at random. Like I say, pick any picture you like. I will do a winner's video. So once I reach 500 subscribers, I will do a winner's video and I'll say, contact the winners as well so you don't have to do anything you know it, I will do everything I will contact you so don't worry about that um, 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 um 
Oh, also, as I've mentioned before, obviously I'm going to be going to Disneyland Florida and Universal for my honeymoon. I'm not going to be able for about maybe three, possibly four weeks, I'm not going to be able to do anything with the shrine. So what I've decided to do instead, because I do actually have a vlog, so please go check out my vlog. Um, because I've got that, I decided that I'm going to be vlogging the whole time I'm away. So I'm away for 21 days, so I try and vlog as much as I can to make up for the fact that I won't be doing two videos a week. Like, you know, I won't be doing a haul or I won't be doing anything to do with the shrine so I hope that kind of makes up for the fact that I won't be doing that for you know, I'm away for three weeks but because I might better do some videos before I go and depends how jet lag I am after I come back I'm guessing it'll be about a month without any of these videos like I said but it will be vlogs instead so I hope you like those like I said it will be Disney it will be Universal you know because we do like Harry Potter as well so like I said I hope that makes up for it um I think that's more or less it. Like I said, my next video is a Primark one. Funny story, I filmed that before filming this. I got my days completely mixed up and I thought my next video was supposed to be a haul and because I knew I had some Primark stuff when I went shopping with my mum a couple weeks ago, I filmed it and then afterwards I was like, that was the wrong video. So, I've already filmed it, I've not edited it yet, so that's my plan obviously, I'll do this one first, edit it, and then obviously do the Primark one ready for, for Tuesday. But it's just like, I've never... Ugh. Kitty cats! Oh, they're fighting. Anyway, I think I was saying, yeah, I was saying that I've never accidentally filmed a film when I shouldn't have. I've always been quite good. I've got like my notes to say, you know, what, what's next, what kind of things I need to, to get on with. And I think that's the first time, I've only been doing this channel for six months, but I think that was the first time I've ever accidentally been like too far in advance where I filmed something being like, that wasn't the next one. So yeah, so please, 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 please subscribe, like, share, you know, if you love Disney, then please share these with other people as well. I'd be so grateful, you know, um, obviously I'm so grateful for the people that I already have. If you watch my vlogs, you'd know that every week I do actually do shout outs to people who subscribe or, you know, leave me nice comments, that kind of thing. So I do want you guys to know how much I appreciate you, but I was so, so, so love to, you know, have more subscribers, more of you joining us. We need to have a name. I've said this before as well. We need a name. What do I call you guys? Um, yeah, I got nothing. So, you know, if it's one of those things, I'd love to have more, more of you in my little family. So please subscribe. I'll be so grateful. Anyway, right, I'm going to stop ranting now and let you get on with your day. Hopefully you like these videos and hopefully you binge watch these and I'll see you next time. Later days. Forget, every time. Every time. And I'm also doing a giveaway, so let's. <coughs> <coughs> this one. Did I. The more they do, the better they've been. You know, the... I did actually buy this. When did I buy it? If you wanted all of them, I will try and find the set. Ooh. I know, something silly like 50 PE or something like that. Um, I was there, I remember.